Hey guys and welcome back to Naruto episode 33. Just before we get into the actual episode, I've got a favour to ask of you guys. Uh, I was recently made aware of a GoFundMe account that's been set up for one of the, uh, a, a long-term friend of the channel, one of my original uh, moderators on the channel, uh, Naomi and her son Talon, who are going through a bit of a rough time at the moment. Um, and if, you, if you've if you got five minutes to peruse the GoFundMe, I will link it in the description down below. And if you could spare anything, then it would be greatly appreciated. Naomi hasn't actually asked me to to show this. Um, to be honest with you, she'll probably kick my ass for doing this. Uh, but it's someone who is uh, one of the kindest people that I know. Uh, that I've had the pleasure of knowing and uh, she's struggling just now and could do with some help. So hopefully the community can actually give back to someone who has given so much to my community and helped me when I was uh, first building the my original channel. And yeah, I don't think that my channel would be doing as well as it has if it wasn't for her helping out in those early days. So if you could support, that would be great. Um, even if you just want to, I don't know, have a read and share it. Maybe there's other people who could also support. But back to Naruto. In the last episode, we had uh, Sakura actually unleashing the beast a little bit. Um, unfortunately, she didn't unleash enough of the beast and she was beaten down by the, uh, the sound ninjas. But right at the end of the episode, coming to her aid was an unlikely ally in Ino, uh, what a drag boy, and... Choji. I forget his name. It's Shik Shikamaru, I think it is. I think it's Shikamaru. Um, Akamaru's the dog. I think that's Shikamaru. And Orochimaru is the bad guy. Hmm. Lots of Marus. Lots of Marus. But what's going to happen is, you know, uh, Shikamaru and Choji going to uh, be off. Be off. That is the worst word to use. Worst word to use. Fend off the, <laughs> the sound ninja. Or is Rock Lee going to wake up and defend them? Is Rock Lee's team going to uh, arrive to back them up? Well, there's only one way to find out, and that's by watching the next episode. But before we do, remember, if you want to see the full reaction, you can do so at the Patreon. The link is in the description down below. And if you're one of the many who are not yet subscribed to the channel, please do consider doing so. But without further ado, let's crack straight into Naruto episode 33. Is he having some sort of weird fever dream? What is this? Where am I? In your own mind. Who's this? It's a younger version of yourself. It's me. A long time ago. Father and mother shouldn't have died. I should be writing this. They're all dead. I wasn't strong enough to save them. Okay, Tanjiro. My whole clan has been destroyed. Like a PTSD flashback. I mean, your entire clan getting destroyed would probably give you PTSD. Battle formation. Ino Shikacho. Ino. But why? Huh, I'm tired of you showing off in front of Sasuke and trying to get all of the credit. These Leaf Village worms will be sorry they squirmed their way into something that doesn't concern them. Are you too crazy? What are we doing here? These guys are bad news, man. Oh, come on, you bloody cowards, man. Sorry for dragging you both into this, but we are a three-man squad, right? All for one and one for all. Yeah, what's meant to happen will. This ain't teamwork. I call this suicide. Why, well, you've got no choice, Joji. Better a live sheep than a dead lion. Right, Fatso? Oh, you didn't. Did I just hear that right? What did that guy just say? Unleash the beast! He just pushed Choji's button big time. You want to try saying that again? Oh. I said you're smart to get out while you still can, fatty. Uh-oh. You done it again? That's twice now. Push the button twice. That's like pumping up a super soaker. Did he just fart? Now this is personal. It's a fight to the death between leaf and sound. Hmm, excellent. He's totally lost it. 
Oh my god. Thanks a lot. Now we gotta live with him. <laughs> Don't worry, it won't be for long. Are you sure about that? Sasuke's the target. Sasuke's having a nap right now and can't come to the door. Your teammates are down. Look after them. I mean, what's she supposed to do? Pat him on the back? Let's show him who's boss. Got it. Formation! Eno! Chica! <laughs> okay, take it away, Choji! My pleasure! Expansion Jutsu! Followed by Lee Style Taijutsu! Oh my god! Oh, that is terrifying. Maybe I'm supposed to laugh myself to death. Slicing sound wave. How's that going for you? Well, an unstoppable force meets an immovable object. Huh? It jumped the airstream. This thing's spinning way too fast. My sound wave can't control it. And if I try going supersonic on it, it's liable to rip my arms off! Choji cares not for your sound nonsense. Oh no, you don't, mummy man. What a drag. Ninja art! Shadow possession! Jutsu! Nani? Shadow possession? What's happening? Huh? Oh, stole your shadow. In my shadow. <laughs> Like that. I'm a little teapot, shut and start. It's some kind of paralysis jutsu. This is my hand. <laughs> this is my spout. Just take care of my body while I'm gone. Oh. Ninja art, mind transfer jutsu. I forgot about that. <laughs> Yoink. <laughs> the mummy guy just caught thin air. <laughs> Jane. No. What's wrong with you? I bet there's some guys out there that wish they could do mind transfer jutsu. Party's over, fellas. <laughs> Take it easy. One false move from either of you and your teammate here gets it in the neck. You don't want that to happen. So here's what you do. Just drop the scroll and walk away. <laughs> when you're far enough away that I can't sense your chakras, I'll let her go. Uh-oh. Hey, Choji! <laughs> what is it? What are they up to? I would be terrified. Oh god. I, I don't understand you. But why is her body bleeding? What kind of monster would attack their own teammate? I guess monsters like us. You see, we don't play this game by your rules. It's not the scrolls we're after or even passing this test. Oh, they don't know. <laughs> Sasuke's got some extreme stank on. Uh -huh. I hate it when it does that. Oh god. Paralysis Jutsu has a pretty limited duration, I see. Shadow Possession Jutsu. Get your Jutsus right. Did you not even listen? Your teammate is able to slip her soul into her opponent. Very clever, but dangerous. Anything that happens to Keen happens to her, too. So she can't kill herself. What are you gonna do? Kill your teammate? Well, if push comes to shove, yeah. Oh, that's a shame. Oh man, what a drag. What a drag indeed. Did you really think you could beat us? Face it, you ninja are just a bunch of hacks. From a second-rate village. Oh! Pretty tough talk. Yeah, punk. I guess that makes your village third-rate. Oh! I wonder if any of you amateurs are ready to take on the real thing. Yeah, boy. It's Lee's team. I wondered when they'd get here. So did I. Poor Lee. Lee! You blew it. I mean, Lee was 1v3, and he was pretty good. It looks to me like somebody used our teammate as a punching bag. No one does that and gets away with it! That's terrifying. I thought my facial expressions were mental. He's not just looking at us. He's seeing through us. Alright, he's got x-ray. <laughs> Full power! What's the matter? Neji? That chakra. Well, are you going to stay up there all day? Are you going to come down here and do something about it? Actually, it looks like it might have been taken out of my hands. Oh? <gasps> oh! Is it? Wait. Huh? I thought it was going to be the bloody Ginyu Force, or whatever they're called. Because I was weak, 
everyone died. I couldn't save them. Yeah, I mean, it's all your fault. Just so you know. If only I'd had more power. <laughs> Instead, you stood by and watched them die. So helpless, like lambs to the slaughter. If, if only you were stronger. If only you had... Uh, so is he trying to, like, brain mess him? Words! Is he trying to, like, um, psychologically manipulate him into becoming more powerful? Sasuke? That's Sasuke? No. Super Saiyan 4 Sasuke. It looks more like, um, Soul Reaver. Sakura, who did this to you? Them! Those are the bad guys. Marks, they're all over his body. Sasuke, what's happened to you? Just some leprosy. It's fine. Wait, why is it only Super Saiyan 2? Oh no, there's four. Told you. It's only the power flowing through me. Wait, no, I thought he did have three. I've never felt better. He gave me this gift. Oh god. And he made me understand what I am. I'm an Avenger. To follow my path, I must have power. He is an Avenger, he's Spider-Man. Even if it means being consumed by evil. And now I see those marks on the neck that the girl spoke of. They were a curse, Mark. But who would have thought he'd survive? More than survive. I don't think Rochi cared about him surviving. That'd be me. Shouldn't have said that. Uh? Eno! Hurry up and get back in your body! You don't want to get involved in this! Yeah, something bad's about to go down. I'm coming! Ah, oh, Rochi. Mind transfer. Release! Atta girl. Good to have you back. Shikamaru! What's this all about? What's going on? How should I know? It's all quite a drag, to be fair. You seem to be on fire a little bit there, Sasuke. What is this? Leprosy, I told you. This changes everything. His chakra is too big. Too powerful. That's what she said. What's wrong? You're not getting cold feet, are ya? No, Saku, you don't understand! His power level! It's over 9,000! One fell swoop! Super Sonic Slicing Wave! There's always one, isn't there? There's always one idiot that is overconfident. What do you know? Blew them all away! Not quite. <laughs> Zaku! <laughs> Such speed. He got both his teammates out of harm's way in the blink of an eye. That's pretty good. Fire style! Phoenix Flower Jutsu! I don't think so. Try this! In the flames! Shoot again! No! Oh, get wrecked! Rip his arms off! I mean, Sasuke was pretty good to be in with. His chakra, it's completely different. It's fiercer, darker. Over 9,000, we covered this. You seem to be that was a Rochi smile. These arms of yours. You must be very attached to them. No! What are you doing? You want it, Sasuke. You want power, don't you? Rip him off and beat him to death with him! Did he just dislocate them? I mean, that's not fun. Should have ripped them off. It looks like you're the only one left. I hope you make things more interesting than your friend did. I mean, that's kind of terrifying. No! It's not... 
Can you not just like donkey punch him and drag him away for a bit? It's not Sasuke. Hmm. Interesting. I think it is Sasuke. If I've seen enough TV shows and movies, we know that tears are more powerful than anything. Please. <laughs> you try to protect her, but she's not wanting you to protect her because it, you protecting her is going to turn you into a monster. Aye? Right? We don't like monsters. Monsters are bad. Also, just then, tears cure leprosy. We're safe for now. So is that like Sasuke's evil version of the nine-tailed fox then? Strong, Sasuke. Uh. Too strong. We can't hope to defeat you the way you are now. Well, no. We'll strike a deal. I give you this scroll and you let us go. Uh. Um, or he could just kick your ass and take the scroll. It would seem we underestimated you. But at least we found out what we needed to know. What's that? That you're too weak? For the moment, we're even. But if it should happen that we ever again meet in combat, I promise you, we won't run or hide. No, you'll probably just die. I also wouldn't recommend carrying your mate by his arm that was severely damaged. Who is this Orochimaru anyway? What's he done to Sasuke? And why Sasuke? I just give him a love bite. All I know is that we were told to target Sasuke, and we did. I don't know why he sent us to assassinate someone on whom he bestowed such powers. I don't know why Sasuke even survived the curse mark. There are many things I don't know. But did he bestow the powers, or did he unlock the powers? Because I reckon it's more the latter than the former. You guys okay? Eno, you look after Lee. We'll check out the kid. Right! That was no normal chakra. I had no idea the Uchiha clan was so strong. I mean, they've got the Sharingan, so yeah. I'll protect her. Don't worry, Sakura, it's okay, I'll save you. That's a thought that counts, Naruto. This is embarrassing. Can I kick him first? Just fart on him. Just what am I? What is this? Oh, oh it's my hand. <laughs> Well, yes, he is. He is Sasuke. You're correct there, Sakura. I'm glad you could elucidate us all. Yeah, interesting. So, did Roche unlock something within Sasuke, or did did Roche just give Sasuke the keys to unlock something that was was within him by psychologically manipulating him in his sleep? to sort of make him almost feel like the entire thing was his fault and if only he was more powerful. I mean, we've seen it before. And uh, I say we've seen it before in anime. Um, maybe not anime, but like TV shows, movies, that sort of thing. To be like, uh, if you were stronger. I mean, it's this, like the the story of, if you've seen the the prequels, the Star Wars prequels, it's like the story of Anakin. You know, where he went to the dark side because then he could have... Spoilers. He could have saved his mother. Um, it's sort of like that trope. Where it's like, oh, if only I was more powerful! And then they hunger for more power and then they find that the easiest route to power is by being evil. Um, because obviously the dark side's got cookies and everyone knows that cookies make you more powerful. But yeah, I, I suppose it's, it's that sort of thing where if you were to compare it with Star Wars, and I don't know why I'm comparing it with Star Wars, it was just the, the first thing that popped into my head. Uh, is is Rochi like the the Palpatine of Star Wars, where he's like, he's like, yes, you can become more powerful, and you could have saved your family had you only been an evil bugger. And if you want to kill your brother, who something reasons that we don't know right now, then you're going to have to. To, to be evil, and if you want to protect the people you care about now, which is apparently Sakura. I didn't see that one coming. But if you want to protect the people you care about now, then you need to become more powerful, and you can only become more powerful by embracing your dark side! And I feel like that's kind of the way that, that 
this is going or went. Um, so yeah, going tropey, I can imagine that Sasuke just ends up turning super evil so that he can embrace the power that he requires. Or maybe I'm wrong and Sasuke actually is like, nah, fam, that evilness, not for me. I'm going to be a good boy and get my powers in the natural way. But I think it's kind of set up that Naruto is going to be the, the good boy powerful one and Sasuke is going to be the bad guy powerful one. But we'll see. We'll definitely see. There's only one way to find out and that's by watching more episodes. But unfortunately, we've run out of time in this one. So as always, thanks a lot for watching. I've been Cedro. You've been awesome. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.